Hello YouTube, want to cover some new purchases uh, in case someone was thinking of picking up some of these uh, and give you a quick rundown. Uh, as you can see from what I've got right now, the most prominent piece that should stick out to most people, especially an Englehard guy, uh, like I consider myself in my short collection history, uh, is this 3 ounce Englehard. Less than 5,000 produced. I have uh, the MFR edition of this bar also. Uh, less than 1,000 of those were produced. These 3 ounce bars are pretty hard to come by. Picked this one up off of eBay. As you can see, dead center of the brackets. Well, chipped it off to the left one. Very good. A lot of the Inglehard stuff was faked a while back with lead and other alloys. Um, some was faked with real silver. And they were taken and stamped replica uh, by all Inglehard uh, back when they were about AG, I believe. But this is the real deal. Three ounce Inglehard, pretty hard to come by. I also have a 5.57 ounce bar from Draper's Mint, Swiss of America. Draper's Mint is another mint that went out of business. A few decades ago, they made uh, some nice stuff, chunky rounds, those five ounce rounds. I've showed a few of those before. And this is a very unique piece. I picked it up from a member on the Bullion Stacker forum for a pretty good price. Those guys sell stuff for very reasonable prices. In comparison to eBay, that's for sure. Uh, also from Bullion Stacker, I bought just a bunch of one ounce bars uh, from a member there. Just to, to add some ounces to the stack. And he gave me seven or eight bars. Some of them are just, you know, uh, the regular Silvertown stuff. You know, nothing too unusual. But then he also sent me quite a few bars that are unusual to me. I haven't seen them much. This one's Refine Met serial numbered bar. It sells for a pretty good premium on eBay. Uh, but not as much as some of the other ones he sent me. Uh, this is a 1973 Middlesex Bank uh, bar. Serial number 28. 52 uh, this sells for a pretty good premium on eBay also as well as this Shelby mutual insurance company all order made bars pretty good pickup I appreciate him for throwing those in there uh, here we have the 10 ounce Year of the Snake round. Pick that up off at Mex. Just to give you a reference as to how big that bar is, anybody that knows the size of an ATB, which is pretty large, that 10 ounce round is even bigger uh, and quite a bit thicker. As you can see, and I like that year to snake uh, quite a bit, so I picked up a little two ounce year to snake round also from Atmex. Got that on eBay for close to spot.
Okay, YouTube. Thanks for watching.